So when you say little, you mean bad? The teacher training department at International House London is the largest, uh, busiest teacher training department in the world. We do more courses than anybody else, which means that uh, our trainers are very, very experienced. Can you think of some words that start with trance in English? Transport. Transport, okay. We offer lots of different courses, and probably the biggest is the CELTA department. Uh, the Cambridge course. It's a pre-service course for people uh, with no experience of teaching or perhaps they have some experience but want to get a qualification or learn new methodology. Okay, so when we say a verb is transitive, we are saying that the verb is transferring to an object. Oh. I've been teaching for a long time. I'm a secondary teacher and I want to um, kind of revitalise my own classroom teaching as a mainstream teacher of English. I have to say it's the single most extraordinary learning experience I think I've had for 20 or 30 years and it's really kind of reignited my passion for teaching. Uh, has anyone had problems with shy students in the class? Okay. The CELTA course is a, is a very practical course. We describe it as a way of teaching you a, a, a toolkit of techniques that you can use in the classroom. What about they have nothing to say? It's normally because they don't understand rather than they don't have anything to say all about setting a clear context. We always try really hard to adapt what we're doing to the trainees, uh, their specific needs, their strengths, their weaknesses. Okay, first question is going to be, who drinks the most coffee, okay? Also a very, very strong practical component, an assess teaching practice component. That involves uh, trainees being in the classroom, teaching, uh, being observed by their trainer and their peers. Okay, so I'm gonna have everyone stand up. I studied for a year abroad in Copenhagen and learned Danish in the time that I was there. And by learning that language, um, I was really interested in language acquisition. So I'm looking to kind of jumpstart that career. Least amount of coffee here. It's going to circle around this way to most amount of coffee here. I feel like it's a very deliberately designed course. Things are structured in a very careful, very deliberate way. Um, and I think that the when they teach us lessons, they teach them in the format that we're expected to teach. Good afternoon, my name's Mike. I hope you are well today. Um, this word here uh, is uh, a verb. Who can tell me what the noun would be? Survival. Good, survival. The reason I'm taking the CELTA course is that I'm uh, hoping for a career change. I'd like to pursue travel a little bit more, uh, but with a different um, agenda, a different scope. Is now talk to your partner. Okay. We don't, you don't sleep for, for four weeks, uh, there, there's no time for anything because... Lots of coffee. Lots of coffee, lots of lesson preparation. There might be one or two words here that um, you may not have come across before. Like the course participants are given um, active feedback immediately after the lesson. One person describes the picture. What's the picture? One person. The support network uh, in the CELTA course is it's very thorough. We have peer support, we're expected to observe and feed back on each other and we, we can't speak too highly of the, the professionalism of, of the main tutors that we've had. So maybe, I don't know how you want to do it, maybe put two sentences on the board, ask them what the difference is. I'm finding the feedback very, very, very incrementally getting more and more challenging, more and more focused and moving you on. So I think there's a real atmosphere of um, teamwork and cooperation and experimentation amongst the teachers and the teacher trainers and hopefully we've kind of um, impassioned them with with uh, the enjoyment or, or the uh, teaching bug if you may. We all know who this is. We also offer uh, Delta courses. Uh, these are for people yeah. who've been teaching for uh, the minimum is a year but normally at least two years. Uh, people who want to develop themselves, who yeah. want to go into educational management, uh, people who perhaps want to become teacher trainers. Altogether, I think we can offer applicants to, to this centre a, a really good training experience. There's a, a library with over 10,000 books, all dedicated to English language teaching, methodology, language awareness. We can offer them very highly qualified trainers. Lots of our trainers are, are also Cambridge assessors uh, or have MAs in applied linguistics or are even are published authors in the field. Uh, so the training trainers are very good, the facilities and resources here are very good, which obviously means that the quality is there. So your dreams, it may not be possible, but I want you to dream, dream, dream in your pairs, because that's how we'll get to know each other. We're willing each other to deliver a great lesson every time, and we're, we're all 
uh, willing each other to get better and better and make more and more progress so that we all hopefully pass the course. Adam and on, Kylie. Kylie. Think of something. Two things that you would love to come through.